In this video, I'm going to show you how to reset your MacBook's password and regain access into your MacBook if you're stuck here at the login screen. And hey, do not worry because this works on any MacBook model, whether you've got a MacBook Pro, a MacBook Air, an iMac or any other Mac device. Without any further ado, let's jump straight into the video. What's going on YouTube? My name is Shaq and in this channel I help you fixing tech related issues. So if you're into tech content, consider subscribing to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you a quickly step-by-step -step tutorial on how to actually reset your MacBook's password. You might be facing issues of accessing your MacBook due to many reasons, such as for example, you might have forgotten your password or you might be having issues with your keyboard. But do not worry, in this video, I'll show you the step-by-step -step guide on how to access it. And we're jumping into the tutorial right now. So here we are, my MacBook is right here. And do not worry if you've got a MacBook, which is of a different model than this one, the steps are exactly the same. So here I am at the login screen. And as you guys can see, I'm gonna try to log in into my username right here. And the very first thing you guys are going to be doing is actually typing the password wrong for three times. Okay, let's do it. For example, one, two, three, blah, blah, blah. Enter. Your password should be wrong the first time. You're going to type it again. Enter. And then three times. Once you get it wrong for the last time, this pop up right here is going to show up. Okay where you've got an option which says if you forgot your password you can reset using your apple id so you're gonna tap right here okay so if this doesn't pop up do not worry simply restart your computer because in some cases it doesn't show up immediately okay simply restart your computer try to log in into your username and miss the password three times one two three times again and then you'll be getting this pop-up right here now another way if you're unable to find the pop-up right there you can easily tap here on this interrogation mark right here which is gonna open the pop-up real quick now please make sure that you do not have any password typed in in here for the question mark to show up right here as you guys can see if I type something the question mark goes away but if I delete the password, the question mark shows immediately right here. So let's tap here on the question mark. And then let's tap here on if you forgot your password, you can reset it using your Apple ID. Let me tap right here real quick. And it's going to restart your computer in a few seconds. Let's wait for it. Here we go. Our MacBook is now booting up as you guys can see right here we're going straight into the recovery menu which is where we're going to reset our password so we can regain access into our macbook right here as you guys can see it's now processing it says examining volumes it's actually double checking all the files inside your disk okay now that we're done it asks us to sign in with our apple id so the very first thing we need to do is make sure that we're connected to the internet, okay? So in order to connect to the internet, you just need to connect to Wi-Fi right here on the top right corner. As you guys can see, we've got in here Wi-Fi networks, okay? So let me quickly connect to this network right here. It's gonna ask me to type in the password of the Wi-Fi network. And once you're done typing it, you're gonna tap here on join, okay? So it's gonna take a few seconds I'm now connected to the internet and let me log in with my Apple ID, which is actually associated with this computer right here. It needs to be the exact same Apple ID, which was connected to this computer right here. Let's quickly type it in. Once you type in the email address, it's going to ask you to type in the password. Let's type in the password real quick. And once you're done typing in your password in here, we're going to tap here on next. Now, if you've forgotten your Apple ID password or something like that, you can also tap here on forgot Apple ID password so we can actually recover in order to continue into the next step. So let's tap here on next. It's going to take a few seconds. It's now loading. Make sure your internet connection is working well. Now, it's going to send a six-digit code to any Apple device which is logged in into your Apple ID if you have any device logged in. For example, your mobile phone is the best 
option for this now in some cases if you're not logged in in any other device it won't ask you to type in the code right here so in my case I've gotten here the code here on my iPhone I'm gonna tap here on allow and then I'm gonna type in this code right here okay nine five eight double three six okay it's now loading it's gonna ask for a few seconds let's just wait patiently and then we've got in here recovering file vault key which are files located security files located here in your computer now next thing we gotta do in here is tap in the user from where we wanna reset our password so in my case I wanna reset my main users password I'm gonna tap in here and then I'm gonna tap here on next okay and then it's gonna ask me to type in the new password I need to repeat the same password and then I need to type in a password hint so that I do not forget it again next time let me quickly type it in my new password here we go I've already typed in a hint as well which is new password so that you can actually remind me that I've set up a new password so that I do not forget it once logging in into my computer next up once you're done we're gonna tap here on next let's go it takes a few seconds to load and then it's gonna say that my file vault volume password has been reset and then I might restart my computer in order to unlock my disk with the new password right here so let's quickly tap here on restart okay and our MacBook will immediately restart itself here we go MacBook is now turning on and we're back to the main screen where we have two users here to log in. Let's log in here on my user and it's gonna ask me for my password, which is the new password that I've set it up right now. Let me quickly type it in. Once I'm done typing in, I'm gonna tap here on login button and it's gonna take me a few seconds to load up all the files. Normally it takes a few more seconds when you log in for the first time after resetting your password because it's actually double checking all the security measures in your computer to make sure that your information is safe and that it's actually you trying to access your computer, okay? Now let's wait for a few more seconds. It's now almost done. And here we go my macbook is now fully reset and we have full access to our macbook device here we go so this was it for today guys thank you so much for making it till the end of the video and if you find my content useful here on youtube consider subscribing leaving a comment down below as it helps me in getting recommended here on youtube so that i can help more people facing the same problem as yours Thanks for watching Fixed by Shaq and I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day.